Agritex grill control systems feature multiple cooling thermostats for equipment control. Cooling thermostats can be used to control equipment such as ventilation fans, air conditioners, chillers, evaporative cooling systems, and other cooling equipment. Let's set up a cooling thermostat to operate a ventilation fan. Navigate to the I.O. tab and select an available output that you would like to use to control a ventilation fan. Let's pick number three. And let's change the name to something like cooling fan. Now because in this application we're going to be using this cooling fan to bring in fresh outside air, we're going to want the CO2 output to be turned off whenever this cooling fan output is on. To do this, we're going to select an output to cancel. We're going to cancel the CO2 output whenever this cooling fan output is on. Let's press the check mark to send these settings to the controller's memory. Once we've set the output's name and settings, let's go to the controls tab. Pick a cooling thermostat. Some default values may be already entered. Let's adjust the default values. The day and night set points represent the maximum temperatures that we want to have in our environment. If the temperature exceeds these values during the day or night periods, the controller will activate the output. Let's select the cooling fan output that we previously labeled as number three. Once the cooling thermostat has been activated, it will continue to cool until it has fallen below the set point by the dead band amount. In this case, the temperature will be regulated between 70 and 68 degrees during the day and 55 and 53 degrees at night. If our controller is configured for multiple or dual zone use, we must select the zone. Zone 0 defaults to number 1 by default. If we have a second climate sensor and we want this cooling thermostat to respond to those temperatures, we must select zone number 2. By default, this thermostat will be responding to the air temperature in the selected zone. If we want this thermostat to respond to water temperature or outdoor temperature, we must make that selection here. The water temperature sensor is an option with the hydroponic sensor kit, and the outdoor temperature sensor is available with the weather sensor kit. Cooling thermostats can also be used to operate vent, shade, and curtain controls. Select a channel to address the VSC2. Select positions to open the vent to during the day or the night when this thermostat is activated. When you have completed entering all of your set points and settings, press the check mark to send the data to the controller's memory. We can see that the cooling thermostat has been activated. When we travel to the I.O. tab, we can see that the cooling fan is indeed on, and the interrupt that we've specified has turned the CO2 output off.